Thank you for giving us this opportunity to share our experiences in education. Uganda uh, is focusing on strengthening the following broad measures in the recovery and acceleration phase of implementing SGG4 within the context of COVID-19. In the basic education system, we're trying to strengthen interventions that ensure access to quality home study materials appropriate for a learner's year or class of study. These materials ensure continuity of learning in the event of, cont of continued disruption of the school system due to in intermittent localized or nationwide closure of schools. In the tertiary and higher education subsector, we are strengthening and expanding the open distance e-learning, which we hope will broaden to include all our learners at that level. In the medium long uh, to long term, curricula utilized in basic education system has undergone and will continue to undergo review to make the learner to focus not only on what must be learned in class, but to promote continuous assessment approaches in learning delivery so that our children can focus on learning wherever they are. Finally, but not uh, the least of measures in the long term, as the science evolves and resources permit, we need to see that as many citizens, including learners, get vaccinated against COVID-19, in the long term, COVID-19 vaccines will play a critical role in restoration of some confidence in seeing a sense of normalcy to life as we know it. This pandemic has been a tragedy for the human family, but on the other hand, it is an eye opener for developing countries to learn to stand on their own. Our universities are now working tooth and nail to discover our own vaccines while we utilize our treatment therapies to cure the pandemic so that Thank we don't continue much. to lose life. Therefore, as we move to forward, our societies are becoming more resilient and also more self-reliant, which is good for all humanity.